Hello there guys, Fusion Master back here again with another tutorial for Click Team Fusion 2.5. Um, <clears throat> today I'm going to be showing you guys how to implement sound uh, into your application, in your games. Uh, I only recently discovered how to do this um, externally. Uh, before, I was using Click Team's uh, little library of sounds, which is sufficient for most games. Uh, but you know you're gonna want some uh, you want some variety outside of that. So I'll show you my favorite website to go to uh, and just how to do it directly in case you don't know. But it's pretty simple. Uh, if you know, Click Team comes already with a uh, with a list of default uh, royalty-free sounds that you can use in the games. They're all converted into the uh, wave format, which is the uh, format you need. You can't use MP3. Uh, or any other. So uh, here, let's load up a new file. Sorry, it's being a little laggy right now. All right. So, um, what you got in here? First off, let's uh, let's have a simple collision going on here. So, how about this? We'll create an active object. We'll create another active object. Then a third we'll have this one be let's say red cube square this one be green and then this is just can be a diamond um, so say upon pressing spacebar. Uh, this is going to launch this dude at him. Alright. So I'm going to start this up. This is about as simple as it gets, program wise. Uh, we're going to have when this diamond hits this guy to make some noise. So. Let's go here, and you're gonna want to type in Sound Bible. Go to soundbible.com. I will put this uh, in the link in the description, so you guys can check this out. This is my favorite website for picking them out because uh, it has a nice variety of royalty-free sounds, uh, and you can directly uh, download through the uh, Wave instead of having to convert it. So let's make a uh, like maybe a bump sound or. A hit sound. So let's see what we got here. So, mm, it's not quite what we want. No. Why not? That works. Oh wait. Ah, I like that. So you come over and you click wave. And it should download directly after you do that. Oh, there you go, I got two of them. Uh, and then we're also going to want a background sound. It's just some background music, so... Let's type in music and see what we can get here. Let's see. There, we're going to have a sports crowd in the background. There you go. Uh, and then from here... I want to head on over here. Sorry about this. Um, and pull up your computer downloads. So let's grab Sports Crowd. And I already have a file for all my sounds. And then let's also grab what was the other one? This frying pan hit. There you go. So I would suggest keeping a folder for all your sounds that you got there. As you can see, I have quite a few. Uh, head into here, and then once you have it in a folder, so let's see. First off, let's do the hit sound. That's the frying pan one. So samples, play sample. Then you want to browse for a file, and you're going to find your file. So my file is Sound Pack Custom, and in here I'm going to need to type in frying pan. There you go. Let's see what this sounds like. 
There you go. Uh, I, I noticed my earlier video. Uh, you guys can't hear sound through here. Uh, like, through recording. So, if you guys can't hear any sound, sorry about that. But, um, yeah, I don't know if you guys can hear that or not. You might just be able to hear my uh, voice, and that's it. Uh, and then if you wanted to add, like, an overlay, like, background noise that just continuously kept going, that's what where the, the sports crowd is. Uh, this is what I do. I do, um, samples. Is a specific sample not playing? And I find the background noise sample I want, so that would be sports crowd for this one. So, if sports crowd isn't playing, play sports crowd. So, whenever this stops playing, it's just going to replay it. So, continuous background. And that's it. Uh, you can blend and you can mix and, you know, do whatever you want with these sounds. But, uh, yeah, that's uh, the whole tutorial. Um, thanks. Uh, uh, thank you guys for watching. Um, if you guys want any other tutorials, you know, anything else you need help on explaining, uh, feel f don't, you know, feel free to ask um, in the comments below. Uh, like, subscribe if you enjoyed it. More content to come. And that'll be all. Thank you guys for watching.